If your Android phone is happening with any kind of errors on your apps which you have downloaded or if you are encountered with virus or malware which is happening on your Android phone and your Android phone has become very slow. If you would like to rectify all these errors and remove those virus uh, which uh, generally people will do the factory reset of the mobile uh, which will erase all the data on your mobile phone. In this video we are going to see uh, not to go for a factory reset we can still erase or, or remove those viruses uh, malways or uh, rectify those errors on android phones let's see how we can do that uh, for doing this one on your android phone you have to get into safe mode safe mode is basically uh, i would uh, tell you after entering into the safe mode what exactly it is to enter into safe mode you have to press your power button on android phone long press after this uh, you will be popped up uh, with uh, power off option just hold on power off option for certain uh, seconds so that it will pop up with a reboot to safe mode just enter into safe mode by just uh, tapping on ok so once you're uh, uh, tapped on that ok your phone will restart and your mobile will straight away get into safe mode uh, which you would be indicated with a watermark safe mode on your uh, left downward side I'll be showing it to you once it uh, goes into safe mode my phone started uh, and boom this is my safe mode on the left side down below corner which has been indicated with uh, watermark safe mode here so once it is there that means your phone is into safe mode what exactly is safe mode safe mode is nothing but by default apps whichever has come with uh, this phone only would be working in this mode all the other apps which you have downloaded as a part of your installation and all those apps won't be turning here and those will not be working in safe mode if you observe all these are into inactive mode and only those apps which has come with this phone is under active so what happens exactly in safe mode how you can eliminate those errors as a part of this one number one you would be removing these errors uh, straight away when these apps only work that means only uh, by default factory apps only works and all other apps won't work and your error whichever is there earlier if you are not getting now means you are not uh, getting these errors because of these company default apps that means latest whatever you have downloaded the apps you can go to play store and uninstall those apps so that your errors will be eliminated so easily and uh, number two because of this safe mode how you can eliminate these uh, virus and malware so I'll be telling you if you are encountered with any kind of virus or malware on all these inactive apps when you are into when you are not into safe mode then those errors or uh, sorry those uh, virus malware will be running uh, background and it would not be allowing you to uninstall those apps whichever is creating virus or malware on your phone so if you get into safe mode you can go to play store straight away and those apps can be stay eliminated so easily by going to play store and third one because of uh, this safe mode you don't need to get into factory reset so that uh, you can be eliminating erasing your uh, data on your phone you'll be saving lot of uh, data valuable data uh, for that matter if you are not into safe mode you would be going 99 percent of people would be doing their factory reset as a part of uh, eliminating their errors or removing viruses on uh, their phone phones so in the safe mode it is not required and you can straight away remove the recent apps uh, for uh, that matter thank you so much for watching this video see you in the next one i hope this is uh, so much helpful to you in uh, getting into safe mode and eliminating your errors virus malware and let's see how quickly this is working in uh, safe mode because nothing is uh, consuming here ram is absolutely free in the safe mode okay subscribe the channel like and share the video for more such valuable content